Hey there everyone, my name is Harry and welcome back to another video. Now you may be thinking, what is all this stuff? Well, I've recently just started again a uh, new world by myself on a uh, Technic pack and um, I just wanted to bring out some tutorials for you guys. Um, I know there's quite a lot already out there but I was thinking, you know, I'm going to go through and do every single tutorial. Now I've only just started so I haven't got really all the machines. Um, the basic ones but yeah that is what I'm gonna be going through with you guys today I am going to be telling you how to build machines and the ones you will need to start up and uh, how you build them and everything like that so yeah I'm going to get started now now uh, first of all first off you will want to probably go mining for a couple of hours and get the minerals you need and materials you need to start the actual process of building machines um, so, first of all, I think we will get a generator built. Now, for a generator, you will need a machine block, a furnace, um, and an RE battery. So, we'll get four tin, just four tin, and um, get eight iron and we will don't know where everything is in this uh two redstone um RE battery we need some cobblestone which I'm not actually sure I've got. I have to get some um just go and get one cobblestone. Um you will need to build as many generators as you want to build so you need one furnace and uh, one machine block and one RE battery. Um, so if we just put take the diamond out. Oh god. Um, maybe a bit too much. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll just chop that back in there. Um, so there we go. I think that'll do. Now you will want to smelt this iron, which you've got for the machine block because when you smelt the iron it will turn into refined iron which you need to make in a square to make the machine block so we just make one furnace here and um, we need a copper cable actually um, don't think we got um, I'll show you guys how to build these things now so once we've got oh, we'll just wait um, I haven't told you guys how to make the uh, copper cables, but basically you can do it two ways. Um, you can either make these things, which are called uninsulated copper cables, and then surround and just put one rubber next to them, or you can surround three copper bars. So that's how you make the uninsulated copper cables. Um, either that, or you can just surround the three iron bars with their uh, six rubber and they're both exactly the same efficiency so if we just get the refined iron now um, I'm not sure what that is how much rubber we got for let's just split this um, yeah so that's how you make rubber the sticky resin um, so we'll go and get some more now and I'll show you guys how to get that uh, we have got quite a lot but if you're new to playing this game you won't know how to get it so if we put the rubber which I've just smelted from sticky resin in uh, any furnace um, and you put it next to the uninsulated copper cables you get copper cables now not many people know the way that you can put that in because they just think you can make six at a time but you can actually make less if you want to which is really handy um, that's my old house and don't even have any use this yet um, I'm not sure I've actually got any rubber trees near so First of all, you need to build a tree tap, which is made by putting five pieces of wood into the crafting table in a way which I'll... Oh, God. I should really build a better entrance to this place. Um, where the wood? So, one, two, three, four, five. Now, I've got a tree tap somewhere here. Um, there. But we'll just make a new one. Um, you put them in a crafting table like that and it gets you a tree tap. Now there's a hell of a lot of crocodiles around here. Um still converting all that back. Uh if I just go and find a rubber tree God I think a storm's coming. Um I will you can then 
make the uh, get the sticky resin. So we'll just head over here. Put I put a waypoint down for rubber trees. So I'm not sure if there's actually any left over there. And I hope there's some sticky resin on them. And apparently I cut them all down. Um, I no longer need rubber trees, so we're gonna have to go on a search for one. Great start, this. Um, great tutorial. So yeah, uh, basically what I was saying before is you need to really get started by just doing a couple of hours of mining and getting all the materials you need to get yourself started. So you'll need a lot of tin and you'll need a lot of copper and you'll obviously need a lot of sticky resin to make the different machines and the RE batteries and things like that um, which I will show you to make in a minute uh, oh there's one over here didn't even know this one was over here let's just hope there's some sticky resin on this one now you're looking for an orange type blob um, oh there we go and it'll look like that on on the, um, the normal texture pack, if you haven't got this one, this is the one which Duncan uses in his uh, thing, which I'll do a tutorial on how to install. Uh, it's basically drag and drop, but you need to install it for the Technic pack or the Tech It. Um, so you get an orange blob like that, and you right click, and it will give you a bunch of resin. We actually got four in one from that one. If there isn't any um, on the lower branches, you can then uh, just. Uh, Pick up the leaves and all got a sapling and see if there's any there. But if all else fails, now this works most of the time. It might not work on this tree, but if you destroy the wood with the rubber, with the tree tap, um, sometimes, and it's a, a low chance, you will actually get resin from it. Now, it's only happened a couple of times to me, but apparently this happens. Um, someone. If you're not a noob and you're just watching this for fun, then correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure it happens. No, it didn't happen on that time, but, uh, yeah. Oh, no, it did. Look, there we go. We got one sticky resin. Um, so, there's a tricky tip for you, if you didn't know that. And you also can collect the saplings, but I don't need to at the moment. Um, I'll explain all this later. So, if we head back now, we should have... Sticky resin, then you smelt it in the furnace, but I'm not going to do that yet. Um, let's just shove the rubber wood in there as well. And I can show you what to do with that rubber wood actually once we build this generator. So, if we now get the rest of our materials out of here, we shouldn't actually need the rest of this rubber, but okay, we've got all the refined iron, I think. Now, if you put the refined iron, which you've just smelted from a furnace, into a square, you get a machine block. and these are really handy, you'll need to learn that recipe. And another recipe you will also need is you get your four tin, put them like that, two redstone in the middle, and a copper cable at the top that makes an RE battery. Now, with these three combined, like that, you can get a generator. Um, if you don't know, you can actually type in the bottom there, like the start of it, and press. Oh, god, it didn't work. Didn't it? No, alright, there it is. Um, and you click R whilst hovering over that and it will give you the recipes. There's another one but it's less efficient because you actually use more iron in the end but um, that is the way to... God. Um, so you've got your generator now and you've just built your generator now you can plug it down and what you want to do is you want to put some fuel into it so you get some coal and you put it in the bottom and as you can see it's generating power and this power can be transferred through wires, which we've got here, copper cables, into different machines. So we'll leave that just to fill up. And um, if we then build the first exchange machine you'll probably want is an extractor or a macerator, like I've got over here. Um, because with macerating things, let's just get some more out of here, let's get an iron ore put it in the macerator oh god that's really loud, um, hang on two seconds ah um, <laughs> sorry about that uh, but it's going to be macerated and it basically does what it says on the tin and macerates things 
So whatever you put in there, um, it's got to be an ore or coal. You will actually get two of whatever it is. So you get two iron dust. Now iron dust can actually be put in a furnace. Oh, and it's loud again. And then smelted down into the actual bar, and then it will be taken off if you've got a system like this. So you will actually get two. I think it's a chance. I think you get two for every one or which you put in. Now I'm not sure if that sticks all the way through, but I'm pretty sure it happens most of the time. Uh, so yeah, uh, I think we're going to build both actually, just so you know how to build it. Now I think we will need another machine block or a generator to build this macerator. So if we get some more iron, let's just take half of it and smelt half of it in the iron furnace. Um, you can build iron furnaces by the way, uh, I'm not going to do it at the moment but I'll just show you. If you put a ring of iron, you get an iron furnace but we don't want that. Ooh, what's that? Iron, oh, just look really weird. <laughs> um, so you'll need either a generator, now you will need also need, god, what has happened there, I've got a shocker, three flint, um, I'm not exactly sure what's going on there, but you'll need three flint, so I'm not sure I've got any of that, uh, I'll have to get, get some, oh no we've got six, so you get three flint, and do you might need smooth stone, or is it cobblestone? Well, we got smooth anyway, we'll just take that. And, um... Yeah, so... I'm just gonna check... Why does it keep on doing that? Ugh! Screw it, we'll just go along. So, we'll go along to the page, and, um... Now, this is a good way to show you <laughs> if you... I do know how to make it, I just... I don't, don't want to build the wrong thing. Um, all of that stuff should be along here somewhere. There's, there's a hell of a lot in here, and it's, and it's quite a lot to remember. Um, so yeah, you got your generators, machine block, electric furnace, which I've got over there, which is faster. So you got macerator, which it is a machine block, and you'll need an electronic circuit as well. Um, so, if we build that electronic circuit first, you will need six copper uh, insulated copper cables, so we'll need another three copper for that. And you will need two redstone and uh, another refined iron. Um, so if we, this is the other way to build the copper cables as you can see it just gives exactly the same so we've got six of them and then you put the six like that two redstone and one refined iron builds you an electronic circuit now we need another machine block which we can't build now machine block electronic circuit now I can't remember which one it is hope it's cobblestone yep there we go and you've got yourself a macerator um, so if we get that and we plonk it down next to our generator and put a cable in the middle of it the generator is now powering the macerator and if I show you by putting um, some gold ore if we put some gold ore in this macerator now oh. Um, it will macerate and it will use up the power in the macerator, in the generator, sorry. You can see it's going down, but we still got coal in there, so it should be able to power for a little bit. Now, this is really inefficient, this generator, um, so you tr want to try and get your, um, oh, it's good, it's windy, um, sustainable energy done quickly, either geothermal, and as you can see, we've got two gold dust we will just put in that chest for now um, and then you can smelt that down into two gold bars instead of one so very handy very handy indeed now the last machine we're going to build to start is the extractor which 
again is right next to the macerator so these are two basic machines and for this you need four tree taps, machine block and another electronic circuit which are the easiest things to build um, we only have five refined iron there so we'll need to we just need four more refined iron oh god there's no coal in there that's winds becoming an eye now. Let's see how much. Uh, I've got quite a lot, and it's still going up, and I'm using things at the same time. Though I've only got one electric engine powered on my quarry. Um. Right, so we're just waiting for this refined iron before we can actually build anything. Oh, actually, we can build a tree tap, can't we? Keep on forgetting where I put this wood. Um. We really need to label these chests. Will that be enough? Yeah, I can build six for that. Uh, they don't stack, which is quite annoying, but they're not too hard to build. And we need the refined iron, which should be done now. Thank you. And we don't need tin do. Oh god, I hope we got enough copper cables. Need one more rubber. I'm just trying to show you guys the way to do it <laughs> if you haven't already prepared your materials like me <laughs> that's no excuse but I think it helps when people aren't just pulling stuff out of chest and building it because it actually shows you how to do stuff um, get that rubber luckily we had just enough otherwise it would have been quite annoying so we get again this is the electronic circuit two redstone Find iron, machine block, yep, yeah. and the four tree taps which go, I can't remember which order it goes in, one, two, three, four, no, other way around, there you go, you got your extractor, now with your extractor, I'm just going to punk it right there, because it, I don't have another copper wire, but you can basically make this as long as you want, and um, you can now power the extractor. Now, I haven't actually shown you what to do with the extractor yet, and I haven't explained it. So, if we just get this rubber wood, if you put the rubber wood, which you've just taken from the trees, into the extractor, which again is a really loud, um, it will turn very slowly and using a hell of a lot of power the rubber wood into rubber. So, if we just wait for that to do it, and hopefully the generator will have enough power. Um, it will turn the rubber wood into rubber and we have our basic machines and that makes it a lot easier to get the sticky resin which a lot easier to make rubber which you will need a lot of now this is going to be the end of the first tutorial I hope you guys have enjoyed if you don't like the video then please comment and see what say what I can do better and if you do like it it would be much appreciated if you could leave a comment and uh, a like and maybe subscribe because I'll be bringing some more tutorials soon and some more videos soon. Now I'll explain all this in another episode but see you guys soon. Bye.